Good morning, and what is happening, fellow pioneers of human transportation? Sunday morning, a little after 9.30. Thanks for joining me for another delivery shift. Even though it looks gloomy, it's not that cold. It's actually like cloudy, and it's just gonna get warmer as the day goes on. If it's your first time checking out my channel, thank you very much. I make videos about really fast scooters, mostly doing delivery videos. I do a lot of review videos. I do trip videos. I appreciate having you here. We're in Hollywood, you can already kind of tell. You can see the sirens in the background. We're definitely in Hollywood. We got our first order already though. We're still trying to keep our top dasher stats. We're at 81% acceptance. Taco, Tacos Gabilon, $5.50, 1.2 mile, and we can walk right in here. There's usually somebody here to serve. That's probably my order right there, too, sitting right there. Rachel G. Rachel. Rachel? Yeah. There you go. Beautiful. Thank you very much. We'll see you next time. All right, we had to wait a second. We got it, and we're not going that far. We're going over to uh, Cherokee. Very nice. Okay, we pretty much know where we're going. Let's double check the map here. Yeah, we're going north. Friends, I have to apologize if the thumbnail is super clickbaity and has almost nothing to do with this episode. I apologize. It's as simple as that. I use clickbait because it gives me more views, exposes me to more people, and I don't think people really give a shit. So I'm sorry, I'll navigate your complaints on that. It's no big deal to me. Apologies in advance, but you know, it is what it is. I feel like uh, clickbait is just normal. And we're closing in on our left turn up here on Las Palmas. Oh no, we gotta go past Highland actually, so a little further. Uh, we're closing in on it. I know we have directions to go in, we have a code and everything. Yeah, it's a pretty nice day out here. It's not too bad. I kind of like I kind of like the temperature. It looks cold, but it's nice. Oh, is this it right here? 1642. Uh, yeah, shit. There it is, there it is. I mean, 1842. Yeah, this is it. I wish that was my guy, but I know it's not. All right, let's get in here now. Hi, it's your DoorDash. I'm here. I tried the different code variations and I also called you, but I'm here. Oh, this customer is really giving me the vanishing act unless this is, unless this is the customer right here. Or is this Rachel? Hi, oh, you're not Rachel, huh? Huh? You're not my customer, but I'm gonna go. Is that okay if I go in? Okay, thank you. I wish you would have seen the look on that girl's face. Okay, so there's no apartment here though. I mean, come on. All right, we got it. Apartment 200. There's got to be stairs here. They're just having a party in there. They didn't hear me. Hi. Thank you. Enjoy. Thank you. Have a good day. You too. You too. <laughs> this is a weird fucking building, guys. All right, let's get out of here. I was prepping myself to leave. I couldn't find my sunglasses. And of course, look at them sitting right here. Fucking crazy. God, I go through so many sunglasses, guys. That's why I'm wearing the old ladies' glasses. I lost all my other pairs. All right, let's go to... We took a brutal order, guys. For $12, 4.2 miles. We're gonna go to McDonald's and then deep into the hills. Let's do it. Our DoorDash acceptance rate at 82%, going on 83. My completion rate still stuck at 94, guys. That is a problem because I think you have to be 95 for Top Dasher. What is this person doing? It's very bad what you're doing, Honda Accord. What's going on, man? All right, so I'm sure the completion ratio will go up eventually. I'm not going to worry about it. I'm just going to continue to do my best job. And as it is, I think it's 70%. They definitely started sending me more orders because I'm just getting DoorDash orders, you guys notice. We did get a couple Ubers, but I think we did one Uber yesterday. Oh, this place is packed. Shit. Alrighty guys, we got it. This place is a fucking mess. I'm happy to get the fuck out of here. It's worth every bit of the $12 that it is paying. Thanks, buddy. All right, we're happy to get out of here because it was a little problematic. It's worth every bit of the 12 bucks. Now we gotta go north. I'm not exactly sure where, but listen to the sat nav. I think it said take La Brea. Fuck. Oh shit. I don't want to wait for you, traffic. I'm sorry. We got to go. All right, let's go. Let's go. There's the police. They don't care about me. All right, we're going to Hollywood and making a lift. That's pretty far from here. No high speed runs today, guys. I'm trying to save battery. 
I got 30 miles out of the scooter yesterday and I needed a little more, but I was doing a lot of mileage in mode four. What are you doing, green car? I was doing a lot of mileage in mode four and that burns a lot more battery. So mode three, because that puts us at about 40 miles an hour, almost 40 miles an hour up this hill. So that's good. This is gonna be a nice long street. The question is, is can I full throttle? I've been full throttling the whole way. We're gonna full throttle through the light? Nah, no way, we back off a little bit. No way, all right, we still gotta go all the way to Hollywood. We got a long way to go. Oh, 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 oh. I'm trying to figure out how to use my fucking horn better. I can barely reach it. All right, slow down, motherfucker. Looks like it's gonna be friendly because that lady in the red car just rear-ended this guy and they're smiling at each other. So I guess they're okay. All right, we can't really stop here. And we gotta get off the fucking... All right, let's go. This is where shit gets sketchy because sometimes the GPS kicks out. We're going into the hills. Oh my God, how far up the half a mile up Laurel? Holy shit. Oh my God, this, the roads here are like okay, but not great, but at least there's not a lot of traffic. I think I've said this a lot in the pursuit for Top Dasher, but this job was the hardest job I've done like lifetime. Now we're looking for 2025. We gotta be close, right? Is it up more hills? How about some, that's 56. The 25 is probably the, number, the numbers go down or it's 50. All right, so we gotta go up. Holy cow. Guys, this is, I can't express how far away we are. 37, and look at, look at this, just, look at this fucking hill. Oh my God. Oh, there it is, oh, we got it, we got it. I definitely have never been here before. Uh -oh. Actions, leave at my door. Leave in front of the gate, please. No problem. That's a little fucking scary. Oh, there's a regular dog. Though. This is fun, being threatened by a dog. Maybe this will be the thumbnail. The customer's dog threatens me, although I'm not really too worried he's behind the thing. All right, what do we get for this? 12 bucks, very nice, let's go. Holy fuck, all right, we're out of here. This is insane, like, delivering all the way up here. They should just build, like, a station of, like, McDonald's, Taco Bell, California Chicken Cafe up here for these people to order from. I don't even know how to get home. I'm gonna have to put on the GPS. This is ridiculous. All right, we got a Target red card order for $6.50 for a mile. It's just one item. Let's just hope it's something easy. Let's see what it's gonna be. Smartly plunger. Okay, so let's go to Target and make sure we ask for help when we're there. If I can't elevator my scooter up, I'm not doing this job. So I'm not leaving my scooter down here. Let's see if I can elevator, take the elevator to Target. I thought this was the Target on Hollywood Boulevard, not this one right here. Yeah, this makes a big difference. I was able to bring the scooter up here and now I can tie it up to this banister over here, take the cameras off and take our time and go in there and find this fucking red card order. It's just a plunger, smartly plunger. Friends, I'm gonna show you one tie up. We do occasionally lock the scooter up. We try to avoid it because it just adds a lot more labor. Uh, we're gonna actually try to see if we can tie the scooter up to this banister and the helmet to the locks because the helmet's a pain in the ass to carry. And I'm telling you, we're gonna walk right in here and ask for help. I don't know where, I, I don't know how to find a plunger. <laughs> That's how fucking stupid I am. All right, so I think we can get the helmet on here too. Yes, this so makes a big difference for the walk around. Fuck yeah, let's go. Your household? Just a plunger, I guess, right? All right, you see that big guy? Uh, the red shirt, yeah. Red shirt, follow him. It's gonna lead, it's gonna, he's gonna lead you right to like right across from the camp file. Thank you. Of course, what we needed was all the way in the back, but we got it. It was actually pretty easy, and I wonder what happened to this poor person where they're just ordering a plunger off the fucking door dash. All right, let's get out of here. All right, it was at least a little bit of pressure, but we got it done pretty quick. I figured out that red card pretty easily, so let's deliver a plunger. All right, let's gear up and go wherever we're going. Lexington, all right, it's not far. Target Center's looking chill on a Sunday. I'm telling you, it's not, it looks cold, but the weather's pretty nice. All right, we're going to Lexington, though. Why is it telling me to make a right on Santa Monica? All right, whatever. Santa Monica Boulevard. I'm pretty sure this is a very easy drop off. It's like one of these open access spots. I think the notes say something like, 
info in the back alleyway or something going on the Your side of the house. All right, so we're close right here. 6454. 6454. 6454. Here it is. Here it is. Yeah, it makes sense. It's down here somewhere. All right, what unit? This is the first time I've ever taken a picture of a weird item like this. All right, let's go. Ooh, paid 650 instead of 550. $2.50 cent tip. That's a good tip for a plunger. All right, so let's take it. Let's see. Let's see what our numbers are before we. Uh, ooh, 84 percent acceptance, 94 completion. This fucking completion ratio thing is gonna drive me crazy. But at least we're getting good orders. We're making all of our money on DoorDash. So let's go back to the target set. Fellow pioneers, I'm gonna take this order out of spite. 4.8 miles for six bucks. This might be our last order of the day. Oh my God, this is insane, dude. We did an order like this yesterday, kind of, right? What's this gonna be for? Griddle cakes, hash browns, food. We're going to Salt Cure. We know where that is. It's right here on Highland. But oh my God, what a fucking order. Oh shit. Oh my God. Oh shit, hold on a second. You ready to be on? You ready to be on my YouTube channel? This is my friend Pete. Amazing, You're gonna be on my YouTube channel. Sure, Give me a hug. This is my friend Pete. Good? We're good friends for Hi, years. Everyone. Master martial arts instructor. Cool guy. I don't think he's ever seen my scooters before. This is amazing. Yeah, this, this is, is a, a major thing, man. Yeah. It's one of my oldest friends from the neighborhood. How you doing, ma'am? I got a uh, Renee D. Yes. Awesome. Thanks, Thanks so much. All right, guys, let's go. Five miles for six bucks. I mean, maybe this will pay more. Who knows? Who would have thought it would come to this? 4.6 miles for six bucks. It's really five miles for six bucks. We gotta go all the way down Highland. We're gonna rage and listen to a little bit of rage. Now we got 1.3 miles to Van Ness. I mean, I just, I've never done orders like so many bad orders like this in one day. Our hourly today is not gonna be like the recent, at least on the other days when we had to do orders like this, we did a good hourly, but this obviously just murders us. It kills our battery, it kills time. I can't, is this really a $6 order or is this my imagination or what? Who knows, maybe I'll get there, they'll give me a big ass cash tip. I've had people see me on a scooter and I know they're like, oh, they have pity on me. All right, here we go. We still got more straightaway. This is insane. This is fucking crazy. These are nice roads, though. If you wanted to have like a race with somebody, these would be good roads to race on. I'd imagine at night, these are probably fucking just great drag racing roads. But the problem is with all these high-end houses around here, they're not going to let you get away with that. Holy shit. Still fucking point eight to Van Ness. Fuck you. I believe we are pulling right up to it, and I just can't tell you. Like, we are so far away from home. This killed our whole shift. We're done after this. We're six miles from home. 927. 927. It's got to be one of these. It's got to be 925, right? Yeah, there we go, baby. Let's go right in. Perfect. 925. Got it like this. Put ourselves in the getaway position in this neighborhood. Number two. Is this number two? Oh, this is the one. Where the fuck is two? Oh my god, I can't see the numbers. Anymore. That's crazy. I had two. Please don't knock on the door. Okay. Oof, I almost knocked at the last second, too. All right, let's go, guys. Now, what did this actually pay out? That's the question. Oh my god. How is the base pay six bucks for a five mile run? Crazy. Holy cow. Did we end up getting screwed today? Let's see how long it takes us to get home. So right now we've been out here for <laughs> only an hour and 33 minutes. So we've done 18 miles. That is a lot in 90 minutes. So let's see how long it takes to get home. Hour 33, 18 miles. I think we're six miles from here. All right, we're just pulling up to the house. What does that say? Hour 52 minutes, 23, almost 24 miles. I think we made like 30 bucks, which is really not the end of the world to make 30 bucks in two hours. All right, guys, I appreciate you following me on another fun video. I don't think I mentioned once about using my bonus code. Maybe I'll put a commercial in this video, but don't forget, you're looking at this scooter or any scooter in my recent videos, you can get $50 off using the Electric Scooter Academy bonus code, link in the description. Otherwise, you can help me out by subscribing to the channel, liking the video, leaving comments, asking questions. Maybe check out my Patreon. I'm starting to get more active on there. Alrighty guys, that was fun. We are home. That was a nice little two hour shift. See you next time. Get the fuck out of bed, bitch, go.